Hi everyone, it's James. You're looking at a Bluetooth USB adapter. I built my own PC this year, but it doesn't have Bluetooth capability. So I needed to buy an external Bluetooth adapter. It's by TP-Link. I bought this through Amazon Japan. That's because I live in Japan. Before I open this package, let's head over to Amazon Japan's website. You're looking at Amazon Japan's website. And this is the Bluetooth adapter that I bought. It's called a TP-Link UB500 Bluetooth USB 5.0 compatible PC tablet compatible adapt Bluetooth handset. It costs 1,299 yen, which is about $9.30 US. Over here it says enables Bluetooth 5.0 communication. Here it says Bluetooth 4.0 higher. Speed and wider range of communication. And here it says simply build a Bluetooth environment. So you can connect all these devices once you attach the adapter. And here it says compact nano size design with a width of 14.8 millimeters, height of 18.9 millimeters, and depth of 6.8 millimeters. Very easy to carry around, no stress, very portable. Here it says sports a wide range of Bluetooth profiles. Since this Bluetooth adapter supports 21 types of Bluetooth profiles, you can connect various Bluetooth devices. Compatible with Windows 7, 8.1, and 10. I'm running Windows 11 Pro. Hopefully there's no problem. Three year warranty, a peace of mind. And there is a domestic support center here. Wireless LAN. Alright guys, I am going to open the box. Three year warranty. Made in China. Okay, uh, in case you need to fix it, you call this number. The user manual, Bluetooth 5.0 nano USB adapter, quick installation guide. It has different languages. There it is, the adapter. Oh, maybe this is in English. Very small. Yes, this is in English. Okay, so connect to a computer. Disable all existing Bluetooth devices, both built-in and third-party, from the device manager on Windows. Insert the adapter into a USB port on your computer directly. Then install Bluetooth driver. Download the latest driver at this address. So I'm going to follow the instructions. And then oh, it tells you how to pair it. All right. So I'm going to get to this. I'm going to have a look at my computer. You're looking at my homemade computer. It has an MSI motherboard. Okay, I'm going to plug this into my desktop. Okay, this monitor is connected to my desktop. As you can see, there's no Bluetooth symbol here. But that's going to change right after I connect this. So I'm going to connect this directly to my desktop. Did you hear that? Nothing's happening. I changed the location of the Bluetooth adapter to the back, and now, what happened to it? There it is. The Bluetooth symbol is here. I'll just double click that. 
and there it is at the top Bluetooth discoverable add device but first I'm going to update the drivers then I'm going to connect my Bluetooth headphones hopefully everything goes well you're looking at my main page HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash www dot t p hyphen link dot com forward slash download download dash center it's in Japanese but we're going to switch it to English it has many languages okay now we need to find the drivers so go over to support download center model number my model number is UB 500 UB 500 UN It's not showing. It didn't work, so just typing UB in the model number, then select this UB 500. There it is. And mine is UB 500 UN as of June 15th, 2021. Let's do that. Open file. Maybe it's this one. It says setup. Yes. Please wait. It's almost done. It's almost done updating the driver. So I recommend doing this before doing anything else. Updating the driver. It's my first time to use this, so bear with me. Yes, I want to restart my computer. You're looking at my Bluetooth Sony headphones. I love these headphones. I'm going to connect these headphones to my Bluetooth computer. Okay, let's see. Where is that Bluetooth? Bluetooth icon should be down here in the taskbar. There it is. So I'll click on this and add Bluetooth device. Okay, what I need to do is turn on my Bluetooth headphones. Okay. It says Bluetooth connected. That must be to my iPhone but I want to connect it to the computer so I'm going to add it here okay here it is Bluetooth come on make sure your device is near your desktop I'll put my headphones a little bit closer to the adapter 
I think I know the problem. Okay, these headphones are connected to my iPhone's Bluetooth. So I'm going to switch this function off. There it is. It should read WHCH510. So I'll connect this. Okay, it's connected. So I'm going to bring my page over. Let's see if you guys can hear it. It is September 4th, You hear that? It works! Excellent! Oh my god, it works perfectly, guys! It really works. Have a listen. Anyway guys, that is it for this video. I love it. Now I'll have a peace of mind with Bluetooth technology in my PC. I recommend getting this. If you don't have Bluetooth and headphones connected to your computer, I love the idea that I can turn my computer into a Bluetooth hub just by using this adapter. I highly recommend getting this. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe to my channel. Bye guys.